physical fitness assessment <gasps> it comes in a styrofoam box Put your leg on the bar. Yeah. Sit down somewhere. Okay. Yeah. Go as high as you can. Yeah. You can, you can lean down. Come here. Yes. Start it. Do start it. Huh? A bit tired already. Hello. I just came back from the gym. Ever since I've stopped my gym membership, I have never been to any gyms and today i have been to um one of the gyms that my boyfriend has been going and this gym actually helps you to analyze your body composition which is super cool we had to take off our shoes and socks and stand on like you know the metal plates and hold on to the what's that called equipment and just let the electrolytes or current flow through our body and I can literally feel the <laughs> Yeah, but it's super cool. So um, a little bit of update after my diet diaries. If you have seen my cheat day video, you will realize that I'm actually not counting calories anymore because I feel like I've been losing weight ever since I count my calories and uh, I don't want to lose any more weight. Here's my physical. I'm reading from my Mac here. So if you think why I'm looking down, I'm looking at my physical fitness assessment report by Active Ash by Active Health. My height one six two point two. My weight forty seven point four. So the funny thing is, I just measured my own weight at home, and it's measuring at forty eight point six or something like that so i don't know which weight is real or false i don't know if the active sg scale is like a little bit spoiled because everybody has been using it just to let you know there's a variance it's super cool because they also show you your segmental composition analysis which shows like how much muscle imbalance or body fat imbalance you have on each of your arms and your legs 
Okay, let's go through the list. Water content. 27.7, normal. I would just like to highlight the fact that I just ate steamboat yesterday, so uh, my body is a little bit bloated. <laughs> That's what people who don't want to face their body image says. My body is a bit bloated. <laughs> but yeah, I ate a lot of like MSG yesterday, so my body is a little bit bloated. Uh, but yeah, it's normal water content. Uh, my bone mass is high. I'm like out of the scale, I'm at 2.9 and actually all along since young I have this comment where like older aunties and uncles will comment like oh your body, your bones are actually very big which uh, I have been drinking milk every single day until I was lactose intolerant so I guess that makes up for the calcium <laughs> body fat uh, is low at 7.8 kg BMI is 18.0 and it's slightly lower than the reference range. Body fat percentage is 16.4%, which is low. I didn't take the fitness test because I don't know how to take the fitness test. There was nothing there. There's no like physical trainer there or whatsoever. I think this is just uh, maybe if you sign up with a personal trainer in the gym and then you get to do the fitness test. Yeah, so fitness test score and total score is all zero. Let's look at the segmental composition analysis. Left arm, does it mean that I'm lean if I have 1.5 kg worth of muscle and 0.3 kg um, worth of fat? <laughs> yeah, but you can see that my right arm, which is this arm, is slightly more lean. I think overall my body composition is quite it's quite uh, balanced. Yeah, so there's a difference of like 0.1 kg worth of body fat and muscle from my left and right arm. Can you tell? Can you tell? Actually, I can feel it. I always feel that my right side of the body is more lean. Then the left side of my body, wait, actually this looks like my left side is more lean. Why if I do this? Okay. <laughs> okay, so anyway, my right arm is more lean than my left side. And my right leg is also... <gasps> okay, my right leg's muscle is at 6.3 kg and my left leg muscles is at 5.5 kg. Which means that my body is very... My legs are very unproportional in terms of mass. Oh, I didn't know my right leg is so heavy. So 2.8 plus 6.3 is 9.1. And then left leg is 2.7 plus 5.5 is 9... No, 8.2. <gasps> 1 kg worth of mass difference between my right and left leg yeah my left leg is always like fatter wait but the body fat is lesser okay but overall i don't know can you see this is my right leg this is my left leg yeah but every time when i gain weight I always gain weight on my thighs first and every time I work out I actually don't train my thighs at all I focus on my core, my arms and my butt Torso muscle mass is 21.8 and body fat is 1.8 which is low but my legs percentage, fat percentage is Hi, cool. So what is the average weight of a, like one leg should be? If you know, please let me know so I can like train more. Maybe I should go to run. Yeah, I haven't run in a very long time. Ta-da! Let's go to weight control and daily energy consumption. Daily energy consumption, but they don't even tell me like my daily energy consumption 
I think the control value is just like how much weight can I manage or like can I afford to gain more yeah I also took my blood pressure it's very healthy diastolic pressure no idea what's that resting heart rate beats per minute okay and when I'm doing the blood pressure test, right, actually I just finished doing some sit up. So I actually expected it to be higher than this. But anyway, this is also healthy. So everything is good. I'm going to try <laughs> to gym at least once a week, including my swimming. I'm also swimming once a week. I mean, learning how to swim once a week and go back one month later to do this test again to see if like there is any difference now i know that my thighs are fat or my legs are fat then i know like which area should i focus on anyway i got this case for only three dollars and i think it's super pretty <laughs> they have black soy sauce this is the chicken rice chili comes in a styrofoam box Ta-da! This is Hainanese chicken rice I added uh, more chicken and eggs So usually what I'll do is I'll take away all the skin I actually don't eat the chicken, chicken skin And this is chicken breast by the way Yeah, it's quite funny I asked for like very very little rice And the shop and the vendor was like, is this enough? I was like, lesser. Is this enough? Lesser. Is this enough? Uh, a little more lesser. And I was like, okay, thank you. Then he was like, are you sure this is enough? <laughs> See you later. Bye. <laughs> Look at my muscles. <laughs>